welcome back to Nicolette Shaper, all things Shaper. And if I'm looking super bubbly, it's because it's Friday and I'm just happy. Um, so today I thought of a really fun video, something that's a little related to shapewear, but like I feel like you girls can relate to. Um, so I know a lot of you girls love to shop at Fashion Nova. I love to shop at Fashion Nova myself. This top is from Fashion Nova. These leggings are from Nicola Shaper. <laughs> um, but today I thought it would be so, so fun if I was able to turn myself into a Fashion Nova model. Um, if you see me, I'm just like a regular girl, you know, 5'1", I lost an inch, I was 5'2", but now I'm 5'1", and you know, I just have a regular sized body. So I thought, wouldn't it be fun if I could transform myself into like the Fashion Nova model? So I went to their website, and I just chose like a regular outfit and like a regular photo that I think I could kind of replicate, minus the shirt. Um, so I found this picture, and I, this is the model Janet Guzman, if you guys are wondering. She has a super tiny waist, um, her hips are super wide, her butt is ginormous, I, let me see that. Her butt is huge, her waist is tiny, and she's just gorgeous. I think she's beautiful, and I'm gonna go ahead and try to transform myself as her, because why not, it's Friday, right? So I had a look at what, um, what I needed. So the first thing that I needed was makeup. So today I did my makeup a little like extra. I did my eyelashes, I put them on because I noticed that she also had eyelashes. So I did my makeup already. And that's the first thing that you need to be a Fashion Nova model, right? Makeup, check. And then I know that she has a really small waist. So to transform my waist into a really small waist, I just got a regular waist trainer, 1026 by Nicolette Shaper. And in my size 32, this should shrink my waist to be really tiny and get that hourglass defined shape that Janet has. Her waist is super defined, so to get that, I don't have it naturally. And to be honest, I don't think, I, neither does she, but this video is not about that. So to get the small, tiny hourglass figure, I have to put on a waist trainer. And she also really has a big, round, almost heart shape, like perfect bum. So with that, I'm gonna wear my waist trainer with a butt lifter because I mean, I have a decent sized bum, but it's not Janet's, so I need a little boost, right? So to get that bum, I got myself a butt lifter. And this is the 8043. I spoke to one of our product experts, and she said that this would give me the best looking bum out of all of the butt lifters. So I trusted with her recommendation, and I picked out this one. And the last thing that we need are the jeans that she's wearing. This is not the exact jeans, she's wearing Fashion Nova jeans, but Fashion Nova jeans will not get your butt that shape. But guess what will? Butt lifting jeans. So I'm gonna wear my butt lifter with my butt lifting jeans that are also the same color because I kind of wanted to do like almost an exact minus the top because I don't have, <laughs> I don't have that top. Um, so I got a very similar cut jean. The back is very similar as well. The only secret is that these jeans are actually gonna lift my butt and make them look kind of similar to hers. And you'll see what I mean. And this will also help cinch in my waist even more um, apart from the waist trainer. So I think this will help me get the look that I want. And let's go ahead and put all of these things on right now and see if I can turn myself into a fashionable model. <laughs> the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put on the waist trainer to get that small teeny tiny waist that Janet Guzman has because my waist is a size um, 30 or 29. Okay, after a long, long time, about 10 minutes of oof, or squeezing myself into this waist trainer, I'm gonna go ahead and put on that butt lifter and the jeans and we'll just see the magic happen. Be right back. I'm honestly so ready to give up <sighs> this butt lifter was not easy to put on because my thighs are ginormous literally they're huge but <sighs> after some blood sweat and tears <clears throat> I got the butt lifter on <laughs> and I am sweating okay so hopefully we're sort of developing the same shape that Janet has I'll put her photo here, and I will do the pose here. So I think I've shrinked my waist about 
three to four inches wearing the waist trainer and then like a bonus inch with the butt lifter so yeah for about four inches and I'm gonna go ahead and try on this butt lifting jeans and see the final product of my little Fashion Nova experiment so I'm not even gonna lie this isn't the most comfortable like I'm wearing like triple compression right now especially putting on these jeans it is not the most comfortable thing but I think I'm getting the result that I want so I'm not mad at it a bonus that I'm getting from the waist trainer is the cleavage you see I, I missed that part she has a lot of cleavage in her yeah she has a lot of cleavage right what I'm gonna do to get the final result Ooh. so here we go this is the final result I don't know I think I did pretty good and then she's showing off her little tiny waist that I kind of have. And then she has the back pose. So let's see how it looks from the back. Oh, silly, right? This is, has to be the silliest video that I've done. I mean, I think I did amazing in the back. I mean, that back really looks like hers. So let's see if we have the heart shape going on, okay? She's just straight doing this. I can't wait to see this. Now obviously if you have a longer shirt, you wouldn't be able to tell that you have a waist trainer there. What do you guys think? How did I do? Did I get Janet Guzman's body with all of these products? <sighs> I mean, I better, right? I went through a struggle to get these on. Then we have this. We got the front view, the back view. So I think we got it pretty good. Like we have the nice shaped booty with the butt lifter and then the butt lift jeans combined with sort of my hard work in the gym. And then I think we have the small waist, big hips on point two. And I give credit, complete credit to the waist trainer because my, I this is not my body at all. Um, so we have the small waist, round hips like her. And then we have a little bit of cleavage. I mean, I can't force it because I don't have it, but like I'll try. And then we have the lashes. I mean, I don't have the same face as her, but you know what I mean, right? Okay, so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I feel so silly with all of these garments on. Oh, you see? But it definitely did give me the shape that I desired. It gave me the nice hourglass figure. So I'm feeling like a Fashion Nova model. Like I can definitely like step into their studio without them knowing and just like start taking photos and I'll fit right in like do you agree I don't, I'm not sure maybe <laughs> but the lesson of the video is don't put such high expectations on yourself those Fashion Nova models I mean they look amazing but it's like it's not natural um they look beautiful like I'm not gonna lie they they're gorgeous but don't put these unrealistic Instagram influencers expectations upon yourself because at the end of the day it took me about three garments to squeeze myself into these jeans in the waist trainer in the butt lifter to actually look like an Instagram or a Fashion Nova model was it worth it Yes, if I wanted to go to a party and if I wanted to look my absolute best, heck yeah, it was definitely worth it. But at the same time, these girls, most of them um, has had a Brazilian butt lift or a plastic surgery. So just make sure that you don't give yourself these unrealistic um, ideas of what a body should look like. It's definitely something that you can get to over time. But just don't feel bad about it. I am a regular girl with a regular body. And I could pretty much form myself into any body that I want. Uh, with a waist trainer, with a butt lifter, butt lift jeans, with a plastic surgery if I wanted to. But just see that it's something fun and you can definitely do it if you want to. But just never ever put yourself down for not looking like that girl on the screen. Because chances are the girl on the screen doesn't even look like the girl on the screen. And with that said, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you guys in my next one. That was a virtual hug. And if you like this video, the little subscribe button is right there. Please give it a click so you don't miss any of our videos. 
and make sure to follow us on Nicolette Shaper Instagram and you can go to our website nicoletteshaper.com to purchase any of our products. I will leave my Instagram down below my personal Instagram if you guys want to follow me and hit me up for any future YouTube ideas or anything. I'm definitely open to chats. You can also DM me on Nicolette Shaper. I am in both platforms. I will see you guys in my next one. I hope you enjoyed this fun video. I had a really fun time filming it and if you want to you know experiment yourself and you want to look like an hourglass angel in your next party or your next occasion girls night out i don't know high school reunion i will link these products down below so you could get the hourglass look see you guys in my next one Bye bye